Hello everyone, how's it going? In this video, we're going to look into what is happening with Cyberlex Corporation, CYBL. So it's not even a penny, it's half a penny stock with sitting at 0.0047 right now. It's under the OTC markets, pink, no information with a stop sign, which means that the company is not being providing a lot of information, particularly in their finances. Now, this company ran up recently, yesterday it was up 6.8% and has been gaining momentum very lately. Now, over the week, it's been up 200%. Let's see what this company is about. Now, going to the website, they're talking about this as a Department of Defense supplier. So they have a contract with the DOD. We provide lightweight, portable, battery-powered, advanced LED lighting systems for special operators. One quick thing to look into is if they're working with the Department of Defense, it means that the solutions or the services are pretty much reliable. And if they are into the services of working with electronics, then these electronics need to be robust, especially with the types of things the DOD does. So it means that the company, the products are very much reliable. That's one thing to look, definitely give it to them. The bright eye and white eye patented products. So it looks like they already have some patents in their file. And here down here, they're talking about for the past 10 years, Cyberlex has operated under its general service administration contract award so if i looked up this particular contract here you can see this is the original contract and it ran from 2006 to 2011. the company was formed in 2000 and this ran up, up till 2011 and i've seen some notifications but i couldn't find information to corroborate that it looks like they have renewed their contract but i couldn't find information to corroborate that information but yeah that's something to look into definitely so this is from the gsadvantage.gov website itself. All these links will be in the description for you to verify and look into it yourself as well. Uh, Congress approves Cyberlux LED lighting for USAF. So this is another one where they're talking about in 2008, the defense appropriations bill includes 8 million to equip USAF with portable LED based lighting systems from Cyberlex. So this is another, so it looks like they, they are in the talks. Now, if you're looking to the Reddit, they are very much active. So this particular post came out two days ago. It has about 43 comments. This came out yesterday and it has about 74 comments. Same thing, so it's gaining momentum, definitely. Now, this is another article that came out yesterday where they're talking about last Friday, the Cyberlick stock was on fire and went up 45% to take its gain over the whole week to as much as 185%. The company is a contracted supplier for the United States Defense of Dep Department of Defense, and that is something that is an indication of the fact that Cyberlex produces dependable products. CYBL stock soared 46.67% with more than 495 billion shares. So there was a huge volume compared to the regular average of 62.94 million shares. So that's something to look into. Now, this is the chart from there. And if you look into the one day charge, the five day chart, you can see definite increase. And if you look into three months chart, right in February, if you go back to six months, right in February, they did have these highs as well. Right now they're retesting that same high. So that's something to look into. Now, if you go to their website, they have this address and this is where the company is located. Because especially when you're dealing with sub zero penny stocks, it's definitely one of the major concerns are whether or not the company is going to survive or whether or not these are you know, long-term legit companies. Uh, so one thing was to look into their web in their address. And if you look upon Google, you, you come across this particular compound where it has different types of other companies. And this particular company, Cyberlex, has a suite in here. And if you look into the zoom in a little bit, it looks like the suite 124 and is registered under Cyberlex right here. They did not put down suite number 122, but it doesn't make too much of a difference. But 1224 or one, maybe 122, both of them are registered. But yeah, uh, that's something to look into. Just found it interesting to share with you. With that, take care. Stay safe. Bye-bye.